Hi, this is clinical hypnotherapist Stephanie Conkle, and I'm going to make this video really short because I have a client coming in any minute now. Um, but I just wanted to touch base with you. Um, <laughs> if you watched the last video, my last video was all about nonverbal cues from the subconscious and how to tell that your hypnoty is going into hypnosis or deeper into somnambulism by observing their nonverbal cues. And one of the things that I totally left out, and thankfully somebody watching the video mentioned it in the comments, but I left out the REM state, so watching for REM or rapid eye movement. So yes, that, of course, that is definitely an indicator that uh, the client or the hypnoty is in somnambulism. So if you just see their eyes just like darting all over the place like that, they are definitely in a state of hypnosis and um, probably even somnambulism or, or deeper somnambulism, like profound somnambulism. So definitely watch the eyes for REM. Now, um, when a person is going naturally to sleep or falling asleep naturally, it usually takes about 90 minutes to get to REM state. But with hypnosis, we can get them there much more quickly. And even, um, even in your own induction, you can help them get to REM state quicker just by adding in a simple eye roll. That's the only thing you have to do to sort of accelerate them getting to the REM state. Because when your client or volunteer or hypnotee, when they roll their eyes up like that, just have them roll their eyes for about, you know, 15, 20 seconds. Don't keep them up there too long or they'll get uncomfortable. But when they do that, then it triggers the visual cortex. And when the visual cortex is triggered, then it's much more easy for them to uh, access the visuals that, that come up in their mind's eye. And then they can get absorbed into the movie in their mind uh, much more quickly. So um, thank you to the person who commented and um, reminding me about rapid eye movement, <laughs> of course. So yes, that is, that's, a, of course, something that you want to look for. Now, um, if you see their eyes just going everywhere, then you can be comfortable that they are in hypnosis. But sometimes it's hard to even see their eyes doing that. So like right now, my bright lights are off and I just have lamps on. I have a client coming in any minute, so I'm making this a very short video. Um, but because it's sort of dark, and some people actually have really thick eyelids, that sometimes it's hard to gauge REM. It's, it's kind of hard to notice REM. So it's not, it, so I'm looking at everything all together, not just REM, but I'm looking for all of the nonverbal cues. But REM is definitely, if I definitely see their eyes darting around, then I'm like, okay, then I know I'm good. But um, if I'm not seeing it, it doesn't necessarily mean that they're not there. It could just be that I'm not seeing it for some reason. All right, so hope that makes sense to you guys. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.